This is the TV News, the industry's only daily video report. Brought to you by American Ingenuity TV. For all of your electronic marketing and creative needs, American Ingenuity TV is simply the solution. Welcome to the TV TV for Thursday, April 22nd. And here are today's top stories. So, you've got a landmark limited series and you need just that little bit of juice to put you over the promotional top. What do you do? Here's what you might want to do. You might want to get the President of the United States to record an open for you. And that's exactly what history has done for the 12-part mega doc that melds American history with American ingenuity. I like that name. President Obama will record some opening thoughts about who we are and where we've been for this Sunday night's premiere of History's America, The Story of Us. Break a leg, Mr. President, and Break a leg history as well. Hey, let's take a stroll down ratings roundup lane, shall we? This past week in broadcast TV, CBS took a sixth consecutive win with total viewers. Fox placed a close second with ABC taking the bronze and NBC a distant fourth once again. On the cable TV front, USA recaptured its customary top spot from TBS. Disney came in second place with Fox placing third, and gaining honorable mention was TNT. We recently reported that NBC ordered additional episodes of their high-tech, carny-type game show, Minute to Win It. And this summer, they'll be putting those additional episodes to good use, mixing them with some encores to create an entire summer season of Minute to Win It. Now, Minute will be acting as a lead-in to NBC's other noted summer offering, America's Got Talent. And now we move on over to Susan Hibben, who has The Programming Pulse. The Programming Pulse is brought to you by Way Out There. Now's your chance to get the Tonight Show of the Paranormal. That's Way Out There. A few weeks back, we told you about ABC readying a live midday talk, news, lifestyle type show. Well now, it appears as though CBS is upping the ante with its own originally produced daytime fare. The Eye is reportedly working on a national talk panel show that's all about moms, for moms, with the early show co-host Julie Chen. Think of this offering as kind of like The View, strapped into a stroller. As the free world already knows, Scripps Networks will be taking Fine Living Dark on May 31st, and in its place will light up Cooking Channel, a companion cooking destination to its own food network. So, is Scripps really just adding more content shelf space with warmed over leftovers from Food Network? Not necessarily. Scripps is promising a more young, low-key, yet hipper offering with Cooking Channel, with an eclectic lineup of programs that range from culinary inventors to shows that examine the roots of food culture. I'll have more on Cooking Channel as launch nears. And finally, TVByTheNumbers.com has added a pair of ABC Unfortunates to its very endangered program list. Flash Forward, which hit rock bottom in the ratings last week, and V, which appears to be heading downhill faster than Lindsey Vaughn. Expect the executioner's axe to put both of these shows out of their collective misery sooner rather than later. I'm Susan Hibben, and I'll see you next Wednesday with the Programming Pulse here at the TVNews.TV. Jeff? Thanks, Susan. Looking forward to it. And now a preview of Way Out There, the Tonight Show of the Paranormal World, available and ready to generate multi-screen buzz and consumption. Elvis has reportedly been found dead in the DCU's car parking lot. Shut up, I think it's a bunch of bull****. Show us the ghost. What's that down there? Why did we notice it now? You're unbelievable. There was a UFO right there. It's coming right, coming right up. We're going to report the sighting we just had. Uh, uh, we've a resident? Yeah. You're unbelievable. No anal probe. What's the point of that?
future events and opportunities. Brought to you by Dude Walker. Get the best voice. Get the best price. Get Dude at DudeWalker.com. The Cable Show 2010 happens May 11th through the 13th in Los Angeles. I'll be on hand and we'd love to interview you about all of the important stuff you've got going on. To register for the show, log on to 2010.thecableshow.com. And if you want to schedule an interview avec moi, you can email me directly at grimshaw at the TV news TV. It's very easy to become a sponsor of the TV news. Just click right here at the TV news TV or drop us an email at advertise at the TV news TV. And June is the time for Promax BDA, the conference 2010. To register, head on over to promaxbda.org. And that's about it for today's edition of the TV News. We will be back tomorrow with top news, and Eric Mackerlin will be here to deliver the sports TV news. I'm Jeff Grimshaw. Thanks for watching, and go out and make it a good day. The TV News has been brought to you by American Ingenuity TV. For all of your electronic marketing and creative challenges, American Ingenuity TV is simply the solution.